What we're doing today is yet another video game. Located in the middle of the screen is a video game that I have actually played before on this channel in a random horror games video. Recently, it has had a full release and located in the middle of the screen is a game that goes by the name of, chat drum roll please, The Stalked. Now, we have actually played this game before in a random horror games video. What we ended up playing was a demo for the full game. And the full game got released very recently and I wanted to see whether the full game is all that it's cracked up to be because from what I recall, I thought the demo was pretty all right. For once, I decided, let me let the devs cook and see whether the full game is going to be any good. I guess without further ado, let's go and play the stalked. Wait, I remember this. Oh wait, made with unity. Let's get another one on the counter. There it is. There's the title screen from before. I, I love how she's just stunned up staring. <laughs> <laughs> the memories are coming back. Anyway, just as a quick refresher, if you guys don't remember um, the uh, the story. Escaped from Liam's obsession, Kate seeks refuge in her grandpa's mansion. Strange occurrences raise questions about Liam's presence or another figure. Unraveling mysterious letters, Kate embarks on a journey seeking peace. Yeah, I think, that, I think that's a good enough uh, context. Let's just begin. Wait. Oh. Oh, we're smooth. I think, I think it, I think it remembered. I had to break up with Liam and I hope he takes it well. Narrator, he didn't take it well. <laughs> All right. Uh, oh no, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. I'm gonna have to do some <laughs> and we are back. And uh, if you want to know why I'm wearing glasses, yeah. Oh my God, we are, we are so slow. We are back in the Tory household from before. Look how, look how rich we are. This is not, it's not even funny. This is like the plot of the invisible man. Did our stomach just rumble like that? All right, let's make sure there's no one here. Anyone here? Anyone here? Doesn't look like there's anyone here. We can't. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's anyone here. All right, let's make some scran. All right, bang, and then bang. Wait, we've got nothing. Though. There's nothing. Where's our equipment? Where's our? Well, I was gonna say equipment. Where's our ingredients? Oh, wait, what's that? Organic food. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, we need to probably probably should shut this. Who would be knocking on my door at this hour? Hmm. I wonder. I wonder. <laughs> Who's there? Hi, honey. Can I? Come in. Oh, Liam, I told you it's over. So no, you can't come in. Come on, you can't just leave me like that. I love you more than anything. It's over, Liam. Just go home. Open the door, Kate. No, I'm not opening the door. I don't love you anymore, Liam. You will be mine again matter of time before they started talking like Sephiroth in my mentions. Sounds like he walked away. Thank God. Food should be ready now. Well, that argument took so long, our food is finally ready. Let's go have the scran. Oh! We just got an achievement. Ate food right off the pan. Are you some kind of psycho? The game, the game forced it. A bath to calm myself down a bit would be great right now. Okay. I'm gonna go to a bit. I'm gonna go to, oh, look at the, wait, is this, Nah, nah, I refuse to believe that we actually own this place. We're a squatter, 100%. Let's look at the... All right, be for real. Look how big this place is. Steve Austin? I wonder what that noise was. Wait, what's this? <gasps> Give me another chance, please. I will treat you well and do anything you want. I promise. Just one chance is all I ask. That can't be too much, can it? XOXO Liam. No, no, no. I gotta leave before he does something worse. Wait, hang on. How did he throw? Where did he throw it from? Does he have superpowers? Okay, what twat names that kid Liam? Yeah, if you're named Liam, that. Hi, Kate. Oh, hi. <laughs> run, run. Run! He just popped up and just like, how did he teleport it? <laughs> well, we're in our car now. Um, oh. 
call him Grandpa. Hello, Grandpa. I need your help. Hey, Kate, what's going on? Liam broke into my apartment and chased me. I barely got away, and now I'm in my car with nowhere to go. That's horrible. Are you okay? Did he hurt you or something? No, I got away before he could do something, but I'm terrified he will find me. Okay, I assume you're looking for a place to stay for a while. Yes. You can come live with me for as long as you need. However, I'm going to be out on a business trip for one week. That's fine. It's still going to be safer than staying here. Can I go there right now? Yes, I sent it the address. The key to my house is in the flower pot. Wait, so the grandpa's going on a business trip into a house in the middle of nowhere? Mm-hmm. All right, then. Also, remember to keep the doors locked. And if you need to go outside, you can always check the people first. Okay, thanks again, Grandpa. You are a lifesaver. No problem. I hope go all goes well. And don't hesitate to call me again. Oh, it's an Android phone. Oh, I remember this part. I do hope that Liam is not at the window. It's Tony Hawk. It's Tony Hawk. Hey, hey! Did he try and open the... He tried to open the door. <laughs> look, hey, look, man, no hands. It's a self-driving car. I Okay, so honestly, I thought this would be slightly improved when the game was out. But why are we driving in Slender's woods? Like, hello? Oh. oh, no. Did Liam manage to follow me here? I'm getting too paranoid now. Of course it's not him. Probably just a neighbor. Why are we driving a diesel? <laughs> Look at this mansion. What in the conjuring house is this? Nah, look. Nah. Press F to turn on your flashlight. Yeah, sure. Really? That is, this is, this is, I think, I, I still think, based on the demo, this is one big fat conspiracy. C O N. Spirits. <sighs> of course that's open. Do not open. I think it's best I don't press any buttons here. It's gonna be like uh, case animatronics. Every time I see a fuse, I always think it's gonna be like case animatronics where it's just... <laughs> Grandpa said the key was in the flower pot, right? All right, the key's in a flower pot. A pot. There we go. Oh, we can choose to lock. Uh-huh. Wow, it's dark in here. Let's turn on some lights and find the bedroom. I want to hit the bed ASAP. All right, find the bedroom. Let's go lock the door as well. Oh, that's going to be a mechanic, isn't it? Isn't the boudoir up here somewhere? Is, it, is this it? This must be it. Are we going to punch the bed? All right, we hit the bed. Wow. I slept that long? Is grandpa home already? I wonder who's here. It bet wait, let's look for the peephole first. Better safe than sorry. You used the peephole for the first time. Oh, that's bait. Because you know there's gonna be a point in the game where someone's just gonna pop in for the people just like ah! Dearest new resident of this mansion, I'm the previous owner of this mansion, and you are the person I've been looking for. I hope to see you stick around for a while. I'm sure we will Get along just fine. I will be watching you. Watching me? This is strange to say the least. Oh, strange! Strange! I need to get going to the store before it gets dark though. Let's be careful. Okay, let's go to the store and I'm gonna actually lock the door. All right, we, uh, we have established that the door is locked. All right, let's go to the store. Come on, Vaminos. Everybody, let's go. Come on, let's get to it. I know that we can do it. Where are we go? <laughs> why is it why is there just a, a convenience store in the middle of the woods? There's just a Londis at the woods. Wow, it's creepy how similar she looks to me. You found a missing person po Now, something tells me, I don't know, something. It's just a small, like, kind of feeling. Something tells me 
that that might be it might be you. Ashley missing since 15th of 8th, 2013. Please help us bring Ashley home. If you have any information, even the smallest detail, contact the police. Your assistance could make all the difference. This is horrible. I hope they found her. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna talk to you. Oh my God, this is turned around. Oh. Hi there. Haven't seen you here before. Are you new? Yes, I just moved in. Where do you live? Why, okay, why is this? This is once again, I must raise the point of this is not a French textbook. I don't feel comfortable telling you that. Are you alone? Okay, um, I'm in a hurry. So sorry, I gotta go. Can we actually get some groceries or are we just gonna? Oh, there we go. Are we just gonna get meatball? We're really just gonna get meatballs and chips, cola. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, you better keep walking. You better keep. Wait, can we leave? <laughs> oh, all right. Milk, cereal. Oh, we're getting wine. That's all. Let's go pay for this now. Hello. Is that all? Yes. All right. The total is $22.50. Huh. Thank you for shopping here. Also, I can tell you are new to the area. How long are you staying for? No problem. I'm not sure yet. Not too long, I would assume. All right, have a good day. And here are your groceries. Thanks, you too. All right, now watch. Was that car there before? I'm gonna peep, I'm gonna peep the... All right, let's go, let's go here. All right, how's this gonna work? <laughs> All right. Let's try it from here. I'm gonna walk from here. Whoa! <laughs> he teleports, he teleported in! You know, a young, beautiful lady like you shouldn't be out all alone like this. What do you want? I do have some wishes, but I think it's best they remain unspoken. Be careful and don't let me catch you all alone again. I don't need your warnings. Respect my space and stay away. Oh. Uh, that's the end of the cutscene. Let's not forget the groceries in the car. All right, let's go get the let's go get the groceries. All right, hang on. There we go. Yeah. And right, I'm just gonna shut this, and I'm gonna lock it. We actually didn't check where the kitchen is, so that's gonna be a bit awkward. Why is it such a big mansion? Why couldn't it have been just like a a studio apartment or something? Look. There's so many possible ways that you could hide or someone could get in. How is there another? Why is the shitter? Why is the, Why is the shitter here? All right, that was quick. Let's. Of course. Of course. Oh, the, the, it says. Wait, how am I gonna show you this? Welcome home. You looked beautiful in the store today. Can't wait to see you again. Why is it a whole network of stalkers? <laughs> I think the um. I'm soon there. I, is he inside or outside? I think the demo ended here. I'm here. Check the door. Uh-oh. Let me check the people. Oh, here we go. Are you actually there? Imagine if this had microphone detection. Are you actually there? All right. Well, it's forcing us to go check the door, so I guess I'll go check it. Dearest new resident, Congratulations on settling in. You may believe this mansion is your refuge, but every step you take reveals a deeper game. I'm with you in every choice, every move. There's no escape from becoming mine. So Liam, okay, Liam owns the place then. This is getting out of hand. I need to drive away and call the police before it's too late. Ah! I, be I bet they damaged the car in before. Oh, I can't open. Ah! No, not now. Start. Start. Please start. Why now? Come on. Why now of all times? Something's really wrong. I, I have to get inside and call the cops. Like right now. I bet in the time it's taken for us to try and start the car. Um, Press F to call the police. All right. 911, what's your emergency? Hi, I, I need help. I've been receiving threatening messages, letters, and texts. I'm really scared. I'm here to help you. Can you please provide your location? I'm at... It's urgent. I understand. I'm dispatching officers to your location right away. Can you describe the nature of the threats? They've been watching me. Follow me. The messages are getting more intense. Please hurry. Stay on the line with me. Help is on the way. 
In the meantime, try to find a safe and secure location within your home and make sure to lock your doors. The officers should be there soon. Yes, they're locked. Please hurry. Help is on the way. Stay strong. I'm here with you until the officers arrived. Actual, actual good rosers? Someone just tried to open the door. Officers will be there any second now. Any second? That quickly? Or maybe it got rerouted. Hello? That was quick. It appears that everything is under control now. Our officers apprehended a man in a white van outside your... Why? In, that's really cliche. The white van, really. <laughs> We're bringing him in for questioning. If something else happens, don't hesitate to call us. Take care. Thank you for your help. I'll be sure to reach out if something else happens. Oh, wow. Well, that was... <laughs> what a relief i never thought i'd feel safe again but maybe things can get back to normal now really really now it should be safe now let's head to the basement outside and restore the power oh i bet there's gonna be someone there where's the, where's the man in the white van this is so bait i think slender's here okay let's do the case animatronics thingy my bob the thingy from case animatronics The power should be back on now. Oh no. Oh no. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. In before the doors open. I'm calling it right now. I locked that door. The door was locked. The door was locked. All right. So it's still locked. Okay. I stink of sweat. Let's take a. <laughs> I mean. I mean, at least, at least they, they just, they just made, um, they were just incredibly honest about it. Just let's take a bath before I go to sleep. Why? That is so booky. That right there, that's incredibly booky. Whoa, what kind of buff is that? <sighs> Finally. <laughs> Finally, a moment of peace. But why would that stranger go so far for me? Whatever, it's over now. The writing is not subtle whatsoever. Wait, is it actually over now? Hey! Hey, oh! Huh? I'm so exhausted that I'm hearing things now. Let's just go to bed. Hey, oh! Oh, that was someone taking a bit. I told you, it's a whole network of stalkers. It's a whole network of stalkers. Watch. We're gonna wake up tomorrow, and I guarantee you there's just gonna be like a um, our fo our photo shows up again. What if it is like white bear? That's what I was thinking. What if we are a murderer or something? <laughs> What's that noise? Oh, that was me. <laughs> that was just me. Oh my God, it's still the middle of the night. Oh, it's all gonna take place in one night, isn't it? Sounds like it's coming from the storage room. Investigate. I don't want to investigate the noise. Oh, you know full well that Liam's already in. I'm just gonna check the entirety of the house. Just in case anyone has managed to find their way in. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. That was just a nightmare. <laughs> like, you just ran out. It was the same guy. It literally was the same guy. I should probably call to check how Liam is doing. I mean, the reason all this is happening to begin with is because I broke up with him. It's all my fault. If I just stayed with Liam, he would have kept me. <sighs> call Liam? No. No, of course not. What am I thinking? Let's put my mind on something else. But first, let's make sure the house is empty. I still don't feel safe. Yeah, like, bro, bro, what, are you crazy? All right, let's go in here. This is where, this is again where we got jump scared. Something looks off about that book. Imagine if it's a secret entrance. Oh my God, I was kidding. I was kidding. <laughs> let's read this. Sudden disappearance. Ashley's whereabouts unknown. 27-year-old Ashley was reported missing on August 15th, 2013 by her husband, two days after she disappeared from her home. Last seen in their residence, Ashley's sudden absences raised suspicions, with her husband emerging as a prime person of interest in the ongoing investigation. While authorities continue to search for leads, they urge anyone with information to come forward and assist in the search for Ashley, where she was last seen. Look, honey. We made the news. Pretty cool, right? And that was on that day. Oh, in before. Oh, no, no. Whoa. Why 
would you want to leave me? I have done nothing but be good to you. Whatever. It doesn't matter anymore. You are never leaving me again now. Let's read all these. Wait, in what order? I think it was... Okay, it's this way. I can't replace you, Ashley. There is no one that's as special as you. Why did you force me to do this? I never wanted to harm you. My fault? How is it my fault? How is it my fault? I didn't want it to end like this. You left me with no other options. Wait, is, is he, are, are you writing this on paper? What the fuck did I do? How am I going to live on without you? What is the point of all this? I'm typing to a dead person. <laughs> am I dreaming? I swear that's you. She looks just like you. Have you come back to me 10 years late? Hold on a second. She's just as beautiful as you were. She has to become mine. She will, no matter what. I can't let her run away from me like you once did. And this is supposed to be grandpa's What? Why did the lighting change? It's probably about time I talk to grandpa about what's going on here. This is crazy. All right, let's go re we, we were reading for that long? Grandpa, are you there? Yes, has something happened? A lot has been happening. I've received creepy letters and been followed by someone I don't think is Liam. I called the police and they arrested a suspicious individual lurking around the house. But when I thought it was all over, I found a strange hidden room in your house that contains some psychotic things to say the least. What? This is insane! Maybe the police arrested the guy leaving the letters! And I had a room! I've lived there for ten- Wait. I lived there for ten years and never seen that! I'll be cutting this business trip short and coming home ASAP! I can't stand not being able to help you! I'd like to think they arrested him, but what if they didn't? What if he's still out there? What if they arrested someone who got set up? Makes me so uneasy just thinking about it. What do you remember about the person you bought this place from? That could definitely be the case! Oh, okay. Maybe the grandpa's innocent. I remember that his wife had gone recently missing without a trace. It was the talk of the town for quite a while, and his name was- What? Are you serious? <laughs> Are you serious? My phone ran out of badger and I didn't have time to bring a charger with me. <laughs> Let's go find a flashlight in case I need one later. I remember seeing one in the basement. Oh my days. I love how it was literally the one trip of like, his name was, <laughs> it's like, it's like what, um, the mentor is about to relay to you important information and dies right before the most crucial point. I remember they did that in the Lego movie really hilariously. There's the flashlight. Now watch, someone's gonna be there. I'm just gonna. We, we can't be hop away. <laughs> the fuck was that? How did that get there? <laughs> I should search for a weapon just in case. Let's start by looking through grandpa's office up. <laughs> All right. All right. All right. Do we have a weapon? What if, oh, if it's a gun, odds are we accidentally shoot our grandpa. What are the odds that we end up accidentally obliterate? Oh. Hey, let me take. Why is it not letting me take it? I mean, at least we know where the key is. So, I mean, we could use that later. But where's our weapon? Where, where are the weapons at, though? That has to be Grandpa, right? It's not. It's not. I think, you know what we can summarize this game as so far? One big clueless emote on screen right now. There's basically 99% of this game's writing. Hi! Hi, sorry if I scared you. I just had to come clean about some. <laughs> of course you did. You're the creep that talked to me earlier outside the convenience store. What do you want to come clean about? I know it was creepy, but it wasn't my idea. Liam told me to do it in hopes that you would take him back to feel safe again. I was supposed to take it a step further now, but I couldn't do it. I felt too sorry for you. It all makes a lot more sense now. Thank you for telling me. I still don't feel safe around you. Can you leave now, please? Yes, of course. I'm sorry again. So it was Liam. It was a whole stalker syndicate. You what? 
You what? Nah. Really? It's night talk. Really? <laughs> Did we take so long to talk that it's night already? But right, go to bed. Are you mad? I ain't going. I ain't going to bed. Now watch, watch, watch. It's gonna. Oh, and did, did, did that come from the bedroom door? Bro, like, you know what I'm, do you know what I'm saying? You thought this was over. You feel helpless now, don't you? Your car doesn't work. Your phone is dead. The police think they got the person behind this, and you don't know where I am. There's nothing that can stop me anymore. Oh my god. <laughs> What do I do? I know if I follow down the other path I saw when I first got here, maybe I can find some neighbors that can help me. Oh, really? The key is right here. I'm just going to shut this door. If he's inside the house, I'm going to lock him in. All right, so we're going to go down this path. Oh, so now we're going to find the pages. Now we're going to have to collect the pages. <laughs> oh, shit. What happened here? This is definitely Liam's car. Liam had a blue car. Oh his, it, oh, his whip was so much better. Um, I've lost the path and we can't go further than this. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, hello. Uh-oh. Oh! 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 Did he have a secret tunnel in the end of the thing? Oh, my God. The, the, this leads directly back, doesn't it? Oh, my God. Wait, blood? Where? Crip? Oh, that's Liam. Wait, you found Liam's body. Um, wait, what? She is my, oh, and only my, oh. Wait, hang on, hang on a second. If that's Liam, then who was phone? Oh, I thought something was gonna pop up. Press shift to sprint. Wait, the fuck? What? Why is it telling me to sprint now? Lads, why is it telling me to sprint? Uh oh. Uh oh. I think I know who this is. Oh, a skeleton appears! I think these are Ashley's remains. What a sick and twisted individual her husband is. I don't even want to know what he'd do to me. And then the second we turn around, he's probably right there, isn't he? Oh, what? Or maybe he is. Hmm. I guess he's just gonna run back then. That's literally the way back. Watch, we're gonna, we're gonna have to- I knew it! Hey, I couldn't wait anymore. I need you now. My new Ashley. It was the cashier. The, it was the cashier. Remember, they- Wait, remember, they, um, they could tell they were new. So... It was you who's been sending these letters. I know I look similar to your ex-wife, but that doesn't mean I can replace her. I don't care. How you look is more than enough. Come here. I've been waiting so long for this. No, no, I have to run before it's too late. Oh, what the? What the? That's not fair. You got caught. <laughs> All right, how are we gonna do this? Where do we go? Do we run after it? Do we run past him? Can I like... Do I have to run past... Oh my god, I have to run. I have to juke him. All right. Where do we go? All right, I'm just gonna moonwalk. Like, there's nothing that you can't go! You can't even slide between his legs! I just realized something. I think it's, I think I'm supposed to be running from that way. Oh my god. You walked around the trigger box somehow. How did I do that? I'm gonna try and reload. Don't tell me I have to start from the top. <sighs> Fucking hell. From the voice of my groaning, my bone has cleaved to my flesh. All right. See, look, it's Wardy there. Okay, yeah, all right, here we go. See, it works now. All right, I'm going. You know what, sorry, I'm, I'm just going. I'm just going, I'm going, I'm going. I hear the roses. I hear the roses. Ah! Uh, survived the stalking. 
you didn't get caught once. The police arrived on the scene just in time thanks to Grandpa. He hurried back home after the abrupt ending to Kate's phone call with him. When he arrived home, he realized that Kate was nowhere to be seen. He got a sinking gut feeling that the worst might have happened. He called the police instantly and they made it just in time. The relief Grandpa felt after the news was like nothing else. What happened to everyone else involved? The man in the white van said that his reasoning for being outside Kate's home was because he saw a stranger following her home from the store. Of course, the police didn't believe him when they saw no one else was there. But when the news broke free about this, the police realized their mistake and that he had actually been telling the truth. He was released the same day. Liam's accomplice was never seen again after the incident. The psychopath who killed his ex-wife Ashley, Liam and almost Kate ended up getting sentenced to life in prison. <laughs> Kate is doing her best to recover from the incident, but it's difficult. At night, she often hears those daunting knocks on her bedroom door disrupting her attempts to sleep. Throughout every day, she finds herself checking behind and scanning every corner, consumed by fear and paranoia. And that... That's really it. That literally was like a where are they now? <laughs> was that really it? So so the key was just a red herring? Oh, one job. One job. Was the speed run even worth it? I'm I'm kind of disappointed that it didn't go the whole route and have Liam run everything. And it decided to go for a last minute twist where it was like, oh, the the, the cashier um killed the cashier killed his wife and that just so happens to look exactly like us i'd say the atmosphere was all right as in there was a sense of dread in the house a house that big and there could be someone anywhere in it that's a perfect setup they had the perfect layup and then they went for the oh there's a bunch of dungeons and tunnels underneath with a dead um where, where, where ashley's body is i don't know what to think about this game for it co it costing money uh what we got it had so many things going for it but that writing was the writing was you know i don't know it still feels like a demo we played a demo then this feels like an extended demo it feels like there could have been more to it the mechanic of locking the door wasn't even it it didn't even get used i feel like they could have done more with like the maybe you come back to your house and the doors open and you don't remember opening it some of the stuff like um having a creep shot taken of you and then the character's just not there that that was more into paranormal um a paranormal activity so i think i'm probably gonna give this one a four, four. out of ten also known as Liam! out of 10 but for those of you guys who want to try the game yourself and try and beat my speed running time uh it will be linked in the description uh if it isn't by the time this video is uploaded let me know uh but those of you guys are watching on the second channel thank you guys so much for watching this video and uh yeah if you want to suggest some games for me to play uh leave it in the comments down below and if you want the plushie by the time this video is out i don't know whether the plushie will be out yet but link in the description to go and place a pre-order for the plushie 200 pre-orders and the plushie will be fully funded but with that being said thank you guys so much for watching this video and for those of you guys on the second channel i will see you guys in another video